<laughs> Welcome back, everyone, to the channel. We need to go talk to these two folks, the two shitty folks. Ron eludes us, huh? Cunning devil. In his hoard, we found relics stolen from Eden. Somehow, Lucifer must have found a way to enter it. Hmm. This is troubling. Eden was sealed after the Nephilim invasion. Powerful artifacts linger amid the ashes, but they've been safely out of reach. Perhaps until now. I will have to do further research. If Lucifer has found a way into Eden, the scrying eye will reveal his methods. We found this map. These scribbles make any sense to you? Interesting. It seems Mammon possesses another vault, larger and even more well hidden. These scribbles have given us its location. We will force the truth from Mammon's lips and show him the cost of dealing with Lucifer. Horsemen, while you fancy yourselves impressive, you both have more to give. Much more. Oh, motivational speech. Hold on, let me grab a drink. The council <laughs> granted you power, but with limits. I can remove those limits to a degree, but you must sense it within yourselves as well. You are bound to your past and to your guilt. This gives the council a vessel to restrain you to suppress that which lies within the chaos the inner riot i was joking about the speech by the way violence what did you do you feel pain however i did not inflict it explain yourself I merely opened the door to your inner conflict, your hate, anger, power. You feel it, and can thus use it properly. How? You will see soon enough. As your rage builds, your potential can now be reached. Its potential you will need to defeat Mamon and other masters that await. Damn! Why do I feel a sudden urge to kill everything I see? <laughs> I'm sure the council will be very pleased. So they give us our chaos farm, basically. He gives us our chaos farm. Hmm. Anarchy farm. Okay, so the strife one is called anarchy. And we knew about the chaos farm that uh, war has. So we are going behind Mamon. So this is going to be a boss fight and a very short episode. In the last video, I just I mentioned that I'm not going to talk about the game. Um, I don't know about that. It's very hard to talk about something other than what's going on in front of your eyes and what you are doing. Um, so yeah, I babbled a lot about the channel in the last uh, video. This video, we are going to talk about the no, game. No, 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 no! Lucifer promised I'd be safe. He said I'd be protected. Ma Mamon is a mouse, he said, then. He promised. Take it, take it all. We're the council's no, enforcers. No, you really think you can buy us with this worthless? No. <laughs> it's not worthless. Oh, okay, you almost had me. Brother, wait. We could have questioned him. Oh, right. <laughs> oh look, he's alive. Happy? So Mamon is pretty big. I'm going to enjoy this. And he is a mouse. So this fight gets pretty complicated because in the second phase as soon as you got him like 50% health 
um, not even before that he starts summoning this uh, additional stuff like here uh, he summons uh, some kind of golden uh, uh, what's that called casket uh, from which uh, you know it will basically spawn new mummies so if you want a uh, additional mission to be done you'll have to defeat mammon without uh, destroying any of his uh, additional uh, uh, like then he gets a mirror he will he gets a book so all these help him by attacking you so if you don't kill any of those but kill mammon you get a trophy or if you kill all of those before you kill mammon you get another trophy uh, not trophy basically a side mission gets done so in this playthrough we will kill mammon without killing anything else Oh shit. Three of them together is a little difficult to keep track of. Suddenly we can't kill this thing? Focus on Mama. Ah, now there is a fourth one too. A hammer. It's like full on chaos. Oh shit, he killed us. We almost killed him, so War should be able to uh, get rid of him. Oh no. Alright. That got hairy in the end. What's wrong, Maman? No more coin tricks? What's Lucifer planning? Start talking, you little shit. We might spare your miserable life. Lucifer shown me treasures beyond any that exist in this world. Your threats mean nothing. Guess he didn't feel like talking. Too bad. You wouldn't have spared him either way. Yeah, I figured it was worth a try. What about all this stuff? <sighs> Leave it. Samael knows about this place now. There's probably enough here to rebuild his army ten times over. You good with that? <sighs> okay, fine. Let's go. But I'm taking the souvenir. <laughs> no, he won't let him take that souvenir. Okay, so Mammon is dealt with. Uh, and chapter 6 is complete. So, we'll go back. We'll talk to uh, the two dudes. And then... Uh, Defeat Mamon, Lord of Hell, and then defeat Mamon without killing any of his artifacts. There is a third. There is a third one where you defeat Mamon after killing all the artifacts. Um, so yeah, we'll go talk to Valgrim and uh, Samael. Mamon. The starting music uh, sounds very much like uh, what's that game? Mafia One. Mafia One had a very memorable uh, soundtrack. Uh, started like that. Um, oh man, I miss that game. But even for its time, it was a very finicky game. Like there were a lot of bugs in that game. Now we have to go up. New items have a little at Valgrim. Okay. Let's talk to them and then we'll end this episode. So, Mammon is no more. <laughs> You've done well, horseman. We're not your executioners. Mammon's death was inevitable. Yeah, my finger slipped. The demon fought us with weapons stolen from Eden. Our suspicions are confirmed. Lucifer has been there. Mammon and I were rivals. I cannot deny that news of his tragic fate has brought me great pleasure. Let me repay you. Bulgrim has continued to track Lucifer's power. It seems he has visited another of the masters. 
Give us a name. Are you still comfortable with our arrangement? You seem to suggest it was not built to last. <laughs> We've already got our hands dirty. No use washing them now. Exactly. <laughs> Words to live by. Lucifer's newest ally is Belial the Corruptor. Access to his realm is limited. But speak with Vulgrim. He will know of a way. Wonder what it'll cost us this time. So we'll go we'll go after Belial this time. Alright, so that's a good time to talk to Valgrim and end this episode. Let's see what Valgrim says, and then we'll be done. At last you've come. I've mapped out the pathways to Belial's realm. However, there is something more I require. There's a shocker. <laughs> uh, what do you need? Tell me, horseman. Do you know of the arena? You mean the hellhole where you fight to the edge of death, suffer unimaginable pain, and maybe, just maybe, escape with your life and a prize? Uh, yes? Yes? Never been. But it sounds like my kind of place. It seems the arena masters have secured a rare talisman that will allow me to quicker find the pathways I need. Unaware of its true power, the fools offer it as a prize. Bring me the talisman, and I will secure for you travel to Belial's realm. That's where we are going next. <laughs> this might actually be fun. For once, we are in agreement. But let us be quick 